My team packs are the most broken they've ever been. And in the last video, I asked you guys for 8,000 likes. We ended up with 23,000 likes because I clearly have the best supporters. With that being said, in today's video, we're going to be opening packs until we pull 100 Dark Matters to see how many Invincibles and Endgames we can pull. So last week's packs were insane. But the reason I say these ones are even more insane is because they have last week's and this week's, they added quite a few invincibles and some deadly end games. Although I think the best card to drop today is actually an invincible. All the end games feel the same. Y'all can see some of the cards from Tuesday. We've got an end game Kevin Garnett added in there, an end game Kawhi Leonard. Y'all know Victor Wembanyama is going to be in there with Yao Ming and Taco Fall already. The Admiral, the Spurs, the Oklahoma City Thunder, end game Hakeem, who I did not open packs for on Tuesday. So looking forward to that. We mentioned Yao. As we keep going, you're going to see other end games. I'm not sure how many there's a total of. I know there's over 20 end games, though, in these packs. You got T Mac, Alaka, the cover of these packs. Although people say the Invincible is probably going to be better. Jonathan Isaac is in there as well. Mo Bamba, Bull Bull, Penny Hardaway. I mean, have you guys ever seen packs like this before? These are better than whatever super packs they're going to decide to drop at the end of the year. I truthfully think this is the final pack drop of the year. And y'all can see they put in Invincible Mark Eaton, Endgame Anthony Davis. And I just keep on going and keep on going. Still looking for that one card that I want to show you. It's not Taco. It's not Larry. It's not Big Z. It's not Ricky. It's not even LeBron. It's not Pippen. It's not Jordan. It is these two right here. Dark Matter George Mirasan, the tallest player in NBA history, and then Invincible Minute Bowl. 99 everything, standing at 7'7", seven seven, and he can play power forward. These packs are broken. And just like that, we're gonna get it started with 900,000 VC, which is how much was enough to pull 50 Dark Matters in the last video. Now, in the last video, we walked away with what? Three end games and only one Invincible? I got a feeling we're not gonna have that same kind of luck, but who knows, man? With the amount of cards that are in here, things could be possible. 28% chance at a Dark Matter. The question is, can we beat the five peat of dark matters that we did last time? Technically, it was six because there was two dark matters in one pack. But uh, to get it started, nothing too pretty. I got my AirPod Pros in right now. I'm listening to that new Travis Scott Utopia album. I don't know how to feel about it yet. There's definitely a couple bangers in there. But for those of you guys that listen to it, let me know how you feel about it in the comments. First dark matter of the day. Now, in our last video, at some point, we got Yao Ming early on. I would not mind getting an endgame or even invincible minutes. I know the odds are going to be tough, and this looks like it's going to be that man from New York. I'm actually happy he got a card. I just wish he got a godly card earlier in the year, but there he is. The left-handed Canadian RJ Barrett. I'm not going to lie to you guys, this is definitely going to be a longer video. I just thought about the fact that we've got to pull double the amount of Dark Matters in one video. And you know what? I'm not even going to talk about 200 Dark Matters. Let's focus on this topic right now. And I might set a tougher light goal because you guys obliterated that first one. This looks like it's going to be back-to-back -back Barrett's. It's kind of crazy to think that NBA 2K24 is just over a month away. Actually, it's not that crazy to think that. I'm already pretty bored of 2K23. I just enjoy making videos for you guys, so that's honestly what's carrying me. Three Dark Matters, though, in five packs. This might be a good sign. Shout out to the logo, Jerry West. But I need something that isn't RJ Barrett. And that is something different. I'm not excited about this pull. I'm excited about this song. Y'all listen to this one. It's a banger. I'm not being paid to say this. Travis Scott has no idea who I am. Let's be honest, but let's keep it going. I need a little back-to-back. -back. Come on, man. No back-to-back -back action so far, but honestly, not a bad start to the box. Last time, we averaged pulling, what, seven to eight Dark Matters a box? So if we can get started like that, I'll be happy. Look, yo, Henry, guess what I pulled out of a challenge pack? Endgame Kevin Garnett absolutely nuts and then this guy out of a challenge pack got invincible minute bowl sometimes i think you guys just post that to troll me and that there is no way that is happening because that's just ridiculous but uh 10 packs in still only three dark matters not a good sign we need to clutch it up here in the second half way to get it started there on the far left who do we want from today's drop that isn't rj any of the invincibles will do i'll take glenn rice I would love Manu Bowl, but I don't want to reach too early. Oh, that's not a good pull. That's nasty work. 
That, that's nasty work. Oh my goodness, we're only gonna get four in this box. Please, last pack magic. Thank you. So we're gonna walk away with five. Give me the luck. Give me the luck, a little change up. Mm. Oh, that's nasty work. I'm not gonna lie to you guys. I should have probably just quick sold the RJ Barrett's because if they're flying out like that with the kind of cards that are out in the auction house right now, he probably isn't going for more than the 3,000 MT that you can quick sell him for. You know, I'll put him up for like 2,700. So those of you guys that are on a budget can pick him up, but can we please get this box started off right? Dark Matter on pack number two, Eastern. Point guard, number 10, that's not the Simmons we're looking for. I forgot this man got an end game on Tuesday as well, but hey, that's a decent start, I guess. That's our second dark matter, and it took 10 packs. The odds are visibly reduced like I haven't seen in a while. I might have to back out into the main menu, I don't know, but it's not looking good. Or so I thought until I saw that gigantic body frame and that right there is going to be the tallest player in NBA history. George Mirasan. I have no idea how glitchy this card's jumper is, but he's 7'7". He's definitely part of a piece of the puzzle into me creating the most broken my team lineup in NBA history for another video. If that's something y'all want to see, let me know in the comments because I feel like we simply got to do it. It's just way too broken. Back to back, first one of the night. That's what you love to see. See, now we're starting to heat up a little bit. Dark matter number three of the box. Ooh, hold on. Ah. Why are these guys even in packs anymore? Like the invincible goes for like, what? 30K at this point. So you might as well just give it to me. I was trying to three P right there, but bit of a better second half here, man. These boxes are definitely starting off slower than they did last time for us. Box or dark matter number four. Show me a good player model. Number four, that's Chris Bosch. Is it the invincible though is the question. Oh! I'm honestly so stunned at the lack of invincible cards I'm pulling. Invincibles should be flying out of these boxes. Right there is going to be another dark matter. This one is gonna be Vinsanity. We know he's not gonna be invincible. Another regular one. On the bright side, it's Dark Matter number five. Still a piece of the puzzle to 100, but I would like to get way more invincibles in end games than I did in the 50. There it is. There it is. We're officially at six Dark Matters for this box. Our best one of the day so far. I just need the juice. We got Mirasan, but I want more. Who's this? I'm not hearing it, Dwight. I'm not. Oh, okay, see, now we're starting to wake up a little bit. What is that, Dark Matter number seven? I think it's number seven of the box. <gasps> they are putting me through so much pain early on. The end game is a Pelicans card, right? I might have to double check. Three Pete on the Dark Matters for eight in a box. Please, make something shake here. Oh, that's a Is that who I think it is? Ladies and gentlemen, we just pulled the best player in packs right now. Manu Bowl for a second. I thought it was gonna be Chris Stapps for Zingis. Let's go! First invincible of the night and it's the best player in the packs. That's how it always works out. Last time we started with Yao as the first good pull. In the same box, we got two of the tallest players in NBA history. Manute and Mirasan. Now I'm hyped. I'm, I'm more hyped inside than I am expressing it because I was a little doubtful at first. Okay, see now these boxes are starting to heat up one out of 20 starting off with that dark matter glow i'm not gonna ask for too much anymore we got minutes but if it can be even better oh heck no oh power forward it has to say small forward for the end game i just finished buying the end game and that's why i don't have as much mt as i usually do guys for those of you wondering it cost me like three hundred and fifty thousand to get that man so if we can just pull him and then sell the other one back Life will be good. Oh, we cooled off for a little bit, but we back for number six. LeBron's number, who I'm yet to pull. And he's actually switching back to 23. And Genie Bus says that he's going to get his jersey retired as a Laker. So big dubs for LeBron there. If I can get him right now, that'd be nice. I have him, but I had to buy him, not pull him. 
And who is the Eastern? Can it be holographic? It cannot. He's shrugging. I need you to have a better year, RJ. I'm cheering for you way too much for you to suck. Please be better. Hey, back-to-back -back number seven. There's the LeBron I'm not looking for. I, I forgot he had that card, actually. But if we get two bronze in a pack... LOL! So this box has definitely slowed down a ton. Number four is going to be on number 12 here. And uh, here's the thing, guys. We've got a lot of dark matters to go. I'm not sure if I can do all of this in one sitting. Oh, I'm pretty sure it has to be a spur. Oh, 2K, you guys are so troll. Absolutely insane. It's the elemental one. It's not even the playoff one. You guys are insane. You what? On my lucky number, we just did the double dark matter pull. I kind of wish we did that off of back to back because that would have been insane. But this counts for two dark matters, so I'm happy. I can already write one down. Hopefully, one of these can be an invincible or an end game. Ugh. Usually, getting one of the greatest scores in NBA history is hype, except for when his cards suck. And that card sucks, which means this one probably sucks as well. That's gonna be the troll Kareem. Let's just fast forward. LOL! Right down the middle, baby. Come on. See, now we gotta get the momentum going. We have a lot of packs to fly through here. We need to keep it going. Another Kevin Durant. LOL! Number 19 is a dud. Can we get that last pack? Magic! Yes, we can! Yes, we can, man. Come on, who's the pink diamond? I'm kidding. I don't care. I care more about who the dark matter is and the fact that we're getting one. Be different. On the bright side, that was eight dark matters in a box. On the downside, they all sucked. So far, I'm pretty much a 450s worth of pack openings. We pulled one invincible. I need this second half of the 900k BC to be better for me. Dino doesn't look impressed by that pack though, should I? Oh my lord. I'm legitimately scared that we might not even get an end game in 100 dark matters. And if I don't, this is 2k exposing themselves with their own pack odds. Yeah, let's just speed run this box. That was by far the worst box of all time. By far. Look at that. Garbage. The worst part about this is that there's not even a trade-off. If I got a bunch of dark matters and they all sucked, at least I'm getting closer to 100. But I think right now we're still only at 26. And we've already spent over half. We're not even on pace to get 50 like we did in our last video. So th this is tough. D Brown, I'll think with you. Can this be something better, please? I don't even know if it's going to be the invincible. Mid. Back to back. Down the middle. That's got to be a good sign. Come on, man. Please get me hyped up. Please get me hyped up. Oh my goodness, wait. Wait. Does it have to be Minnesota? Oh. 420 is a troll number, but I'm willing to make a sacrifice here, 2K. Bryce McGowan's, I'm sorry I don't know who you are, but a necessary evil had to be made in order for us to get something crazy. Please. Please. Lol. I'd like to offer Bryce McGowan's a formal apology, and you guys will see where that card is from in tomorrow's video, which is going to be a banger. We just got a back to back and I'm not even going to react because I am getting beyond trolled right now. Trolled like nothing I have seen in a while and is that Tyler Hero again? Oh, hold on. I'm pretty sure the Invincible is a primary center indeed. Oh, this is tough. Numero eight for Kobe Bean Bryant. Something special has to happen out of this. Did we just do it? Please tell me that's gonna be the first end game of the day. Let's go, ladies and gentlemen. So it doesn't play shooting guard. He plays power forward and he plays small forward. I'm just relieved right now. I've been getting trolled so much that I'm trying not to overreact. End game number one is in the bag. Let's go. Back to back end game more invincible. I need the juice right now. I'm not even mad. That's two Bulbuls and an endgame Kevin Garnett. In any pack opening in any other my team, that's an insane W. As long as Dark Matters just keep flying out, I don't care what happens the rest of the box. We've secured the end game. Yes. I just want more of them going. Keep spamming the X and let's speed run this. Does Dwight Howard have an invincible or endgame this year? I don't think he does. I could be wrong. 
two Dark Matters in a pack twice in today's video. This is by far the most juiced box. We've already got seven and this is gonna be eight and nine. We'll start to the left because that's where Beyonce is always going. Give me something good here, man, please. Well, um, that troll was no surprise. We're gonna go to the right because Beyonce ruined everything for us. Maybe there's something nicer on this side. And it was a bag-to-bag -bag. three dark matters in two packs. That's what you love to see This is what we need if we're gonna reach a hundred, but that's not the I get literally every LeBron in the game Except the end game. It, it's so bad. We're currently sitting at 10 dark matters in this box Anything else we get is a cherry on top and to think we still have four more packs We pulled 10 dark matters in 16 packs Make that 11 and 17. Patrick Mills, he looks happy. Again, I'm not mad at it because we've already got the end game out of this box. Just keep giving me as many dark matters as you can because that's what I need right now. Make it 12. 19 out of 20 is a dud. Can we break the record and get 12 in one box? No, we can't. I actually don't know what the record is for most dark matters in a box. I think I hold it right now at 11. If anyone else has had more, show me proof. Look at how many trolls were in this box, including a troll Kevin Garnett before we got the end game. Absolutely insane. Box number five was the momentum shift that we needed. There's still a chance we can get three end games in 50 packs again. First dark matter of this box is gonna be at six and B doesn't look impressed, so it's gotta be good. It's RJ, oh my goodness. Back to back. Numero seven, James Harden. There's a lot of talk right now about James Harden and Dwayne Wade. Who do you think is higher all time? That's back to back RJs though. Did we just three P three in the middle? Nope. Was the first one in the middle? No, nope. it wasn't. I don't think it was. Back to back in the middle though. There's no way I get three RJs, right? <laughs> There's just no way. Who's this? Western? Center? Number 53. That's an invincible right there. I don't think it's a normal dark matter. Ladies and gentlemen, Invincible number two, Mark Eaton. What's crazy is that this man's dark matter is already so broken. Without a doubt in my mind, this card's gonna be insane. We just four-peated. On a box that was looking slow. Back to back Invincible me. Back to back Invi- Hold on. Nope. Ah, too bad. Another end game I've never pulled, Jimmy Butler. Unfortunately, no signs of any five peats tonight. We had like, what, three in the last one, which is what made us reach 50 so quick, but nah, this journey to 100, <laughs> this is gonna take a while. Numero 14, Rudy is looking right at the pack. It's always good when a player does, I swear. Oh, that's the troll one, right? I remember how hard this card used to be to pull, <laughs> and now he's just flying out of here. Pack numero 17, my boy Shaden Sharp. You know what, guys, I've been thinking. With how crazy you guys hit the light goal for 100 Dark Matters, maybe we gotta raise the bar. You what? I don't think there is any way that you guys get 20,000 likes in order for me to chase 200 Dark Matters in one video. In fact, I'm begging that you don't do that. But that would probably end up being my last pack opening of 2K23, going out with some insane bang. For now, let's focus on getting the 100 because uh, that's still super far away. Yeah. Loaded up another 900,000. Honestly, please don't get the light goal for the 200. I don't think I'm gonna be able to do that. 420, blaze it because the packs are hot. Honestly, I don't know how he didn't get an end game. He's been hooping this year, like hooping, hooping. That's so troll. I just keep getting trolled. Guys, I need y'all to promise me one thing. You are saving your money and not wasting them on these packs. Do not spend a penny until 24 comes out. And even then, it's always good to save your money. So if I've been keeping track of our Dark Matter pulls, this right here is officially going to mark number 50. Last time at number 50, we had three end games and one invincible. This time, we have two invincibles and one end game. One other end game would even it out because Manu Bowl, he was pretty much an end game pull. So give me something good, please. Anything but RJ. And I think this is actually going to be an invincible pull. 
Let's go, Glenn Rice. For those of you guys that played NBA 2K20, you should know. So we got three Invincibles and one Endgame this time. Last time we had three Endgames and one Invincible, but I actually prefer the Invincible pulls on these ones than the Endgames. Actually, that's a lie. We got Yao Ming. That's a good way to hit that 50 milestone, man. Especially because uh, that only tells us we're halfway, but that right there is already going to be number 51. Come on, now we can amp up the energy a bit. Ah, uh, LeBron, you're killing my mood. On a serious note, though, man, prayers out to Bronny James. I mean, I'm pretty sure he's doing a lot better now, but definitely sad to see that happen to a ton of young athletes. I haven't seen that stupid, gigantic bald head in a while. Get Megamind out of my face. There is an illegal amount of RJ Barrett's in these packs. Who was it that we were pulling last time? I already forget. My brain doesn't try to keep attention to that stuff. It it's nasty. Back to back? Nope. Four Dark Matters only in a box. That's bad. So now we just don't have any Dark Matter showing up. Still none in this new box either. Definitely not a good look. We've been opening packs for over an hour, so 2K is probably like, um, my brother, it's time to put the console down. There's our first one of the box. Not Froby. Lonzo Ball. We do get it back to back. So unless the second half of this box is beyond juiced, things are just not looking good in general and that... Okay, we weren't dreaming. End game bowl bowl pull. I have never pulled it. I didn't know how to react. I was so unimpressed by how bad this box was. I'll take it. I'll take it. Have we pulled an end game yet from today? From today's, oh, we did pull Kevin Garnett. Where did bowl bowl come from though? This is one of those times where I'm okay if the rest of this box sucks. If we only walk away with two Dark Matters, that's fine, because one of them is worth low-key like 10 of them in my head. So if we get like, if I, if I can walk away with three or four, that'd be nice. That's gonna be the third one of the box, man. As if Endgame Bobo just decided, you know what, I'm gonna bless you up. Bless me up twice right now. I have zero hope this is the Endgame, but I also have complete hope that it could be. He's stretching Mom. his arm. Dang. So I might actually need to take a break. You guys can see we're in this new box, five packs in, and not a sign of a single dark matter again. There's our first one at number six, but the more I look at this, the more I realize this is insanely expensive. Do not try this at home. Don't even get the light goal. Oh my goodness, see, now we're starting to heat up. At least we're pulling some bangers. Oh, it's all giants. And I'm completely okay with it. I would have been happy with an endgame Anthony Davis or someone, but this man just might be better than all of them. Again, I haven't seen his jumper. I'm just assuming so because he's borderline seven foot eight. Some back-to-back -back action. Now, obviously, some of you guys are tagging me on Twitter, showing me your insane pulls. So for those of you guys that do end up opening packs or get something out of the challenge pack, let me know what your best pull was from today in the comments. For now, we focus oh eastern i'm not mad at it we haven't seen this man in a while and as long as the dark matters just keep flying right now i'll be happy we've gotten a couple end games and invincibles we're gonna three peat right there i'm not asking for much now i just want you to give me mid and high volumes because we need to fly try it. called it four and it's down the middle that means it has to be something good that's way too much mid in a row for something nice to not pop up and okay, I say I haven't seen this man in a while, so it's okay. Now he decides to fly a bunch of times. I don't want to see you anymore. That's enough, Shaq. Go back to TNT. Keep broadcasting. Get out of my packs. Is that our first 5 Pete of the night? I think that's our first 5 Pete of the night. Is it the right penny? Give me the right teammate. Oh, that's cold. I officially forgive you for the box where I only got three Dark Matters. Six in a row. Let me know if anybody else has done that yet. Oh my goodness, I'm gonna get trolled again. I'm here for it though. We embrace the energy.
I don't care if it's in a row. I need at least one or two more to make up for those last two boxes. Come on. Thank you. Right down the middle, too. Make it crazy. Kobe. <clears throat> Mid. Last pack magic. <laughs> right down the middle and that's gonna be the eighth dark matter of this box please bless us we got mirror song but i'm hungry i want more and that's just gonna be out of position jimmy the g stands for gets a lot of him i would like his end game instead but look at that man he's going to the auctions kickstarting box number 11 with a dark matter rose oh <laughs> I was literally expecting for it to be the garbage one, but I will, I love it. I love it. Kickstart this box with the Invincible. I was doing the math, and when I said box number 11 out loud, I had to multiply that by 20, and that's how many packs we've opened so far. So we've opened 210 packs, 220 packs after this box. That's a lot of packs. Number five out of 20, that's gonna be another dark matter. That's already another invincible we've added. Make it two of them. Why not? Why not? Who's this? For a second, I was thinking end game, and then I realized the only end game is that pacer. But that's a card I haven't seen pulled in packs in a while. So it looks like as we continue to open, they're adding different cards and shuffling some in. So hopefully we catch a window of a new end game in here. And I'm pretty sure that right there is another invincible. Two of them so far in this box. Show me the Anthony Edwards. One of my favorite players in this league right now in holographic fashion. And it's a three-peat, I think. Is it a three-peat, a four-peat? I'm not even keeping track anymore. All I know is another one is flying out of here. Would have been absolutely ballistic if we got three invincibles in four dark matter pulls, but we still got a chance. There's 13 packs left in this box right here. I don't ask for much 2K. I would just love one of the super glitchy end games. Throw a Yao in here, a Wembenyama, a Taco Fall, even one of the newer end games from today like Kawhi Leonard our fellow Raptor King who brought us a ring come on I'm rhyming already accidentally Chris Smooth style who who is that another card I'm very surprised does not have an invincible when I did call 2k out though for never giving Clyde an invincible in history he did get one earlier this week so now I'm calling you with Oscar RJ Barrett once again I actually haven't seen him in a while so I'm not complaining but because I said that he's about to fly out even more rest of the box definitely sucked but hey man pulling two invincibles in one box definitely feels awesome I'm happy about that number one out of 20 to start this new box I see Anthony Davis that man has an end game we pulled a ton of his normal dark matter can I not see this hero card mainly because he sucks back to back it's getting scary oj mayo that's a name i have not seen or heard in a long time but hopefully this oh my goodness 2k has a unique way of making me hate players that i love i do want to see another canadian get an invincible though like jamal murray you know the man that recently won an nba championship that'd be nice wrong benjamin simmons i actually haven't seen a troll tracy mcgrady which i'm surprised about because we pulled a lot of that radiant t-mac in previous pack openings and now he just doesn't want to show up i have never seen a player fly out of packs like we are rj barrett so i'm doing the math here in our first six boxes 43 dark matters the six boxes after that 33 a drastic drop the journey continues Seeing out of the horse mask was hard. I, it's literally impossible unless I look through the nostrils here. I can't see a thing. Second dark matter pack number nine. Bah. Come on, let's go, baby. Come on. Horrible. That's my lucky number. I can't do it with the goat mask anymore. Enough's enough. I need the, oh my goodness. Guys, we're struggling. This journey to 100 is not as fun as the 50. Please let them fly out. I am running out of VC here. Have you guys seen the video of Jokic winning the horse racing championship? He was more excited for it than the actual NBA championship. What a funny guy. Low back-to-back -back dark matter here. We need as much as we can get right now. I don't care about what we pull. I care about the volume and... Ha! Well... We're gonna three-peat with Dark Matters, but um, I've been trolled so much at this point that I just have no reaction to anything. 
Zero. Well, if it isn't Taiwan Tyranitar, I got bad news. We don't have enough for boxes anymore, so it comes down to the singles. I think we still have like, what, 17 or 18 more Dark Matters to pull, so we've still got a journey here, but hey, I feel like the singles might be blessed. It was blessed for us last time. I need it. Nope, not that. I think this is 85. I should have kept track of how many RJ Barrett's we were pulling. This is nasty work. Another one. Come on, Steve Clifford, get hype with me. I really wish the Invincible one was in packs. This is horrible. Yes, sir. Come on, we're getting closer and closer. 87, be good. Devin Booker, 36 unbothered, man. Using the nose for good luck. Flip. Hit X. Ow. Oh, hell no. How long must I get trolled? Back to back on a single, which usually would be fire, but I'm not seeing any sign of hope here, man. That's Josh Giddy. There's a lot of variation in the singles, actually. <laughs> yep. Gambling. For this dark matter, I offer you my Anthony Davis figurine. Tell me this isn't fire, though. <laughs> We've pulled like 60 RJ Barrett's. And this is our first holographic one. 96. I'm starting to lose hope. I haven't eaten or drinking in hours. And I don't- Whoa! Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. <laughs> ah, there it is. Another invincible card, and it's Mark Eaton once again. That's a big dub, actually. I'll take that. I'll take that. The end is near, but my hope is not. 98. Two more after this. Oh my god, I'm about to get trolled again, aren't I? First LeBron, now Jordan is here to put a hole in my chest, isn't he? <laughs> 99. The end is near, guys. One more. And it's all done. Is that another invincible Mark Eaton? That's the third one today already, and on 99, I wish that would have happened on 100, but hey. And ladies and gentlemen, just like that, we've done it. 100 Dark Matters, call me Will Chamberlain. The question is, who are we finishing it off on? Please be amazing, man. Please. Let's go! I'll take that! Finish it off with an Invincible! It would have been insane if it was Endgame Wilt for 100, but obviously you can't script stuff like that. Ladies and gentlemen, 100 Dark Matters have been pulled. I'm exhausted. Here's how many Endgames and Invincibles we got. I'm not even gonna try to do the math for RJ Barrett's. It was horrible. Do not make me do this with 200 Dark Matters. Until then, I'll see y'all later. Goodbye.